Sea view. Hunter. Now Casey knocks one forward for Gary Haylock. Good ball for Haylock. A little touch. And it's just gone in. Nice throw, headed away by O'Brien. Back to Carlisle. McKeown needs to make sure, headed on by Kennedy. It's a goal for Portadown. Flick on for Kennedy. Drives it in low, in towards Candlish. Now here's Haylock. It's 3-0 for Portadown, and it's becoming a bit of a rout. Headed on by Ferguson. O'Brien slices it, and it's gone in. That's three goals in four minutes, and a hat-trick for Gary Haylock. Dwyer, back pass all the way to McKeown. Haylock pressurising. Casey, Casey's header. Now here's Ferguson. Ian Ferguson. Makes it 5 now. McCown, way by Peebles, only as far as Deegan. Now Burroughs. Oh, that is a wonderful goal by Sid Burroughs. 12 minutes gone in the second half and something for Crusaders to cheer at last. Crusaders haven't cleared the danger yet. In by Casey, hangs in the air. McKeown has to make sure he's missed it. And it's another goal for Portadown. It's Gary Peebles this time. Well, I mean, I've been long enough in the game, Stephen, to know that uh, you get freak results in football. And I don't get carried away when we win an equal. I don't, I don't get that, that depressed when we lose. I think you've got to, got to keep an even keel about the whole thing. And as I said, as far as we were concerned, Saturday's result w w was a bit of a freak. And uh, as, as I said, Ray Walker looking at tonight's result is the same thing. And it'll be a hell of a match and we play on about 14 days time. <laughs>